Hey there, boys and girls. Uh, this is going to be in a new series for me on how to install OpenBox on Arch Linux. As you can see, I am using XFCE right now. Um, this is actually a bridge Linux uh, build. So I'm going to convert this to OpenBox. So we have a to-do list, what we need to do here first. Um, so as you can see, if you want to start off with OpenBox right on, installed on Arch, I, I highly recommend ArchBang. It's a very good distro. They have a lot of uh, good stuff built right into it and a lot of shortcuts and all that. Uh, Arch Linux and the wiki has their own OpenBox entry also. It has good features and uh, things that I don't do, they might be doing. But uh, this is the way I do it. So our first thing to do is we're going to install some programs that we need. Obviously, we're going to need OpenBox, uh, OpenBox Logout, so we can log in and out. Uh, OpenBox Menu, for uh, to edit the OpenBox Menu. Uh, themes, uh, OpenBox Config does all your, your theming and all that. Um, Tint 2, which will be our panel that we use for our clock and our window list and and our uh, systems. And I also have included here GM Run, which we can make as our Alt F2 key so we can execute things without running them in uh, terminal uh, just to get us started so we can get Tint 2 going and things like that. Uh, and these are all from the main repository um, that you can get through Arch through Pac-Man. Um, the Arch user repository, uh, we need a couple of things out of there. These are my own options again, uh, but you can get them. Uh, Openbox Key, this uh, keyboard editor, and Tint Wizard, which is the Tint 2 editor, it's a GUI, and Openbox Menu, which will give us icons and give us a nice dynamic uh, menu in our in our right click so the first thing we need to do is we need to copy a couple of files that aren't in our home directory normally so first one is a menu because there is no menu in our our very basic open box um, as you can see I've already copied these over but normally the only thing that's normally left in here is this rc.xml and so I've already copied these two lines over so we need a menu and an auto start file and the auto start file will tell openbox what to start so if you want to start conky or you want to start your your background manager like nitrogen you can do that <clears throat> or if you want to use uh, feh uh, you can use that for setting your background. Um, and a good start, once we get these copied over, um, go into that rc.xml and add a line to it. So What we do is we scroll down here and we have key bindings for running applications right down here. So all I did is because I have XFCE it it uses XF run 4. Um, once you install that GM run you can substitute the two commands and the name into there and use that instead but I'm just using the default that came with XFCE since it's already there. So get them all installed and then we log out and we log back into our open box session if you have a problem and it's not showing up um, install lx session also and that will uh, help it get into your um, startup menu i'm using light dm and i actually had to install the lx session for open box to show up in my my sessions on my uh, login. Alright, so log out and I'll see you in a minute. 